What is up everybody and welcome back to another Among Us video and in this video I'll be telling you about a player by the name of Crew Poster. I'm sure you have heard rumors about a mysterious player who is not only a crewmate but also an imposter. Well recently according to several players they have seen Crew Poster in their game and he is a very dangerous player that you never want to encounter. I actually managed to encounter Crew Poster in Among Us and I'm here to reveal everything that I witnessed while playing against him. And before we get further into this video, 70% of you have not hit that subscribe button which means that you're missing out on Among Us Darkest Secrets. So why not solve that issue by hitting the subscribe button with the bell icon turned on. And if you enjoyed this video and want to see more make sure to leave a like down below. But now let's begin with today's story video. So my encounter with Crew Poster started off on a regular match of Scaled. I did notice him at first but I didn't really pay much attention since it could have just been a fake account. But I was wrong. The match had started and I was a crewmate. I went off to go do my task cause at the moment nothing strange has happened just yet. I did a few tasks in electrical and when I walked out I saw Crew Poster just standing there. I went off to go do my task and he started to chase me down. He teleported a few times but I didn't really think much of it since this Among Us update had many bugs and glitches. A few of the crewmates were trying to get my attention so I walked into medbay with them and Crew Poster randomly vented in. I was in disbelief that he randomly did that but things got even worse. Crew Poster got on top of the medbay scanner and started to scan himself. Didn't he just vent a few seconds ago or am I seeing things? He finished his medbay scan and vented out. So I walked out of medbay and I checked the security room and he was just standing there doing his wires. For the next few minutes I was just completing my task and while I was in storage I went down into the trash area and I saw Crew Pasta do his task and then he randomly killed Lime. I tried to report Lime's body and it wasn't letting me but luckily one of the crewmates managed to do it. I opened up the chat and I said um I just saw Cyan kill and vent but he did trash in medbay. I mean he's a crewmate and imposter. He killed and did trash. Crew Pasta then said I did submit scan and I responded with I don't know how he did that. Black was accusing him of being a hacker and I didn't believe that was strange. I just never encountered a hacker that wanted to be a crew poster. A few other players were confused in the chat and I let everyone know I don't even know if we should vote him out and we all decided to skip which was a terrible mistake. The meeting ended and we all went to go do our task. As I was walking around I just couldn't believe it. How is this player a crewmate but also an imposter? And why does he want to be both? This doesn't make any sense. While me and crew poster were in electrical he vented out. So I went to go check security to look for him and when I arrived he was standing above or Orange's body. I reported the body and I let the crewmates know I think it's Cyan. Kruposta then responded to the rest of the crewmates, please do your task. Wait what? <laughs> Did he just tell us to do our task? But wasn't he the imposter? I'm just going to skip. I don't even know what's going on anymore. We all spawned in once again and we went out to go do our task. And I was just in disbelief. Out of my entire time playing Among Us, I've never encountered a player like this. I've heard rumors about crew posters, but I never actually encountered one. Usually they're just a bunch of trolls, but this was real. He could do task and kill players. I went off to go look for him. I wanted to see what he was up to. And while I was in navigation, I saw the vent move and it was crew poster. I was watching him do his task and then he vented. Why is he trying to get away from me? I luckily managed to find him in the admin room and it looks like he was finishing up his download. In the admin room, he started to lag out and teleported outside and killed Green. White called the meeting and told everyone that he saw Cyan vent. I responded with what in the world? If there's two imposters, would we win? At this point, I didn't even know if we had two imposters or one. Crew Pasta then told the crew that he did upload data. I responded with good enough for me. I honestly just wanted to see what he would do at this point. Nobody was ejected and we tried to stay as normal as possible. While I was in cafeteria I saw Crew Pasta on top of the table and a few minutes later he killed White. I ran out of the cafeteria and I went inside of the reactor room and I was hiding in the corner. I just didn't want him to kill me. The lights weren't turning on so I went to go fix them but luckily the crewmates managed to fix it on time. I then saw Crew Pasta inside of electrical and and he vented. So I went over to security and he killed Black right in front of me. I was running around the map because I was fearing for my life. As I was trying to report Black 
Black's body in security, Krupposter vented in and killed Purple, and he won the game. So he was an imposter, but how was he doing task? It was now the next game and I typed in the chat. I thought you said you weren't the imposter. Several players in the lobby were also questioning what was going on, and how the imposter managed to scan. I responded to the crewmates and I also let them know that I saw him do medbay and trash, and that he killed everyone. It was now the next game and I was a crewmate. I wonder what crew poster is gonna do this match. I followed him in the beginning of the round, and he went off to go do his task, like a regular crewmate. But then I caught him venting in navigation. I went to go check in the admin room and he was nowhere to be found. Maybe he's just cleaning the vents. I didn't see him for the next few minutes and I was looking around trying to find him. While I was in navigation, I went up to weapons and I found crew poster and he was doing asteroids but he vented earlier. So so far he has done all three visual tasks. In the last round, he did trash and medbay, and now he's doing asteroids? After he finished his asteroids, he just vented out, and when I walked into navigation, I found Brown's body. I stood there in disbelief. It didn't let me report the body, so I went back to weapons, and I found another victim of Crew Poster. And once again, I was unable to report. Crew Poster started to do the asteroids once again, and was venting. I couldn't take this any longer, so I walked into cafeteria, and I wanted to press the button but it wasn't letting me. I didn't want to stay in one place so I ran away. And while I was in shields, Crew Poster vented and was doing his task. Pink showed up and then was killed and Crew Poster left. I have seen so many crewmates die next to me and I could do nothing to save them. But we're still playing a regular match of Among Us. So it's my duty to complete my task. I was trying my best to keep my cool and not freak out about the entire situation. There's only a few tasks that we need to complete in order to win the game. So I need to focus. But it's so hard to focus knowing that a player like this exists and he's in your game. I only had one task left and it was my card swipe. But when I walked in all the sabotages were called. I entered in a panic. I didn't know what to fix. I was fixing the O2 but I had to fix the reactor as well. Bodies were everywhere and I couldn't report a single one. But before I could fix O2, Crew Poster won the game. I opened up the chat and I said, now I see why your name is Crew Poster. I didn't even bother to see his response because I left the game. But I don't think this will be the last time we will see Crew Poster. He's still after me. If you would like me to encounter Crew Poster once again in Among Us, let's see if we can get this video to 25,000 likes. I do also want to give a massive shout out to Lazy Doggo for helping me produce this video. If you would like to help out a smaller creator, make sure to go check out his channel and subscribe to him. And if you're new to the channel and want to see more Among Us story videos, make sure that you hit that subscribe button with the bell icon turned on. And make sure that you check out one of these Among Us story videos that I found on my channel.